Hello everyone and welcome back to Neo. We're picking up where we left off in this dojo. And we are gonna be starting the tutorial. So I sort of went through this with the beta, but I wanna go through it again just for the sake of refreshing my memory. So quick attacks, light attacks. Probably would have been helpful if I actually had my sword on, but it counted anyway, so don't worry about it. Lock on and switching targets. Ah yes, I have to run over here now. And who knows, there might be some differences between... I feel like doing the tutorial like this is a good thing. Um, reason being... It actually makes you practice the techniques. And it helps you get them in your head a little bit better. And key pulse. There we go. Actually, I had to let it do the thing so I could purify it. That's my fault. So everything's coming back to me. Now we get ranged things. Okay, so... Oh, there's a second one. I didn't see you.
living weapons. Okay, this I want to actually read over. So when the Amrita gauge is full, press those buttons. When living act, and that's to activate living weapon. And the guardian spirit skill. When a living weapon is active, press those to activate their skill. Triggering a living weapon changes the health gauge and key gauge into a living weapon gauge, and as long as the living weapon is active, you are impervious to damage, and your close combat attacks inflict more damage. The living weapon gauge decreases over time, and when the enemy attacks land, and once it's depleted, the effects wear off. When it's active, press those buttons to perform the Guardian Spirit's unique skill. Okay. Okay. Cool. Alright, let's go forward. I feel like that was a good refresher. Just because it's a new game, you need to get used to things like that. You need to really take some time and actually read it. So, that's what we did. In a way, I wish they had kind of done that first, but that's okay. So that's what we chose at the end of last time. They're ready for us to make landfall. Blah, 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 blah. Let's leave the cabin. Alright, continue. Those sails on that ship are a little worse for wear. I think my brightness is up way too high now. That's better. So, not quite sure where all my stuff from before went, but that's fine. Don't have enough to make an offering yet, or to level up yet. Change our guardian spirit, but we're not going to bother with that. Boons, checking DLC. That's where all that stuff from getting the season passes. So we'll just confirm that, why not? That's a lot of stuff, my goodness. Okay, well, um, let's look at everything we have. Clearly we're going to use that. And we're going to use that. That's a lot of really good stuff to start with, my goodness. <laughs> yeah, this is kind of a ridiculous way to start things off. I'm honestly kind of surprised that it's starting us off with this much good stuff. Like... Wow. That's, like, this is all really good. So, Season Pass gets you started up really, really well. If I 
could not embarrass myself, that would be wonderful. Let's try that again. Honestly. Oh, I wonder... I didn't start with any ranged weapons. That probably would be a little bit overpowered if you started with ranged weapons, though, to be honest. And we do have the ability to learn a couple skills. So, first things first... Do we want grapple? Probably go with flux and grapple. Although, we should look at the Kusurigama. What are these? I always forget. Right, they require missions. So changing to another stance on um, key pulse increases the amount of key recovered. So that's kind of a big deal. Um... Other than that, we have two... Those are ninja skills. So... Ready shuriken... Poison applied to weapons... Antitoxin. That's gonna be useful. We might go that route. Paralysis... Resistance to it... We'll do that. That's useful. Sacred water will be helpful to have. And we'll go with some shuriken. Why not? And can we prepare those yet? Should be able to. Let's actually start this up and make some progress. Ooh, I should have grappled. How do I grapple again? I just went through this. Oh, that's all that it is? I don't know why, I thought grapple was something different. Yeah, we'll fight this revenant. Why not? Yeah, I don't want to walk off that far. That would probably be death.
So this area, if I'm not mistaken... Nice. I like that. I like that a lot. Okay, Kusurigama. It's a good time. I see a green thing. Hello, my little friend. Get on over to that shrine. So this was the area for the... Alpha? I think? I don't know, I didn't play the Alpha, so... It looks like the videos I saw. I can say that at the very least. It's a very From Software-esque location to hide something. Uh, not skills, but equipment. I want to check... ...the stuff that I have. Stones are good to throw, and... Oh, right. I want to see if I got any better armor. I doubt it, in all honesty. This armor is awesome for this point. And yes, the Ogre's Mask. But... Eh. Nothing better. That was cool. Is that better? No. My god, this is ridiculous. Like, I almost feel bad that I'm using such powerful stuff. I'll come back and fight that one. Not quite sure why that broke, but I'm not going to worry about it. Keep running in head first, and I shouldn't be doing that. That's a bad idea. I keep accidentally hitting R2 as well, which is again not a good idea. Um.
bring this in. Wasting too much of my key. I know that I am, and I know it's going to start biting me in the ass really soon. I almost got the drop on me. Almost. On the bright side, at least I'm getting a lot of stuff here that I'll be able to sell, because it's not going to be valuable to me. Accessories yet. Hum. Oh boy, that's a problem. I feel like I might have done better with my spear on that one. And finally we have a ranged weapon. It's about damn time. No, get off me. Get off of me.
<laughs> I died here, yes. Great name. 10 out of 10. Hey, one of these guys. Hello, friend. There we are. Okay, was the flip really necessary, though? Let's be honest now. You're just being unnecessarily fancy at that point. circle. Well, isn't that nice? And we've got 4,000 Wutsumadusit, and we can receive a Kodama, Kodama Blessing. Blech. So we want the Elixir one because... what's Release Blessing do? No, I want that. I want that very much. Um, we want the Elixir one because we're not getting much in the way of Elixir drops at all, so we kind of want that a lot. Um, now, as far as level ups... Let's take a look at that. Body will affect our spears, so we could literally just dump quite a bit in the body. Which I'm considering doing. Which one affects my... Kusarigama. I would assume dexterity. That would only make sense. So we're going to go a little bit in body. Honestly. Might go a bit into heart as well, for the sake of having more key. I don't know. I think our key is actually doing okay. We're just going to dump it into body and make our spear super good. And we need 2,000 Amrita to get another level. And as far as being able to get there, we can do that. Is that overkill? Yes, it most certainly is. I was not paying attention. Don't worry about it. And... Would it be dexterity that has the effect on it? Or skill? Because it, it's not actually saying which one it would qualify as. I would assume it's a more technical weapon, so skill would make more sense. For the time being... We'll just dump it in dexterity. If I need to respec later, there was an item in the beta that let us do that. I'm assuming that exists in this as well, in the full game. Those are only worth 100 each, and that won't get me to a level, so this is where we're going to end things, but not quite yet because we can learn some skills. So, not dual swords, but spear. I want to get that. Do I want the spear shove? I don't think I do want the spear shove. Actually, I do want that. 
I take my I take that back. Alright, so we can get a bunch of ninja things done. So let's get some kunai in here. Let's get this. And let's get some anti-poison. Um... Paralysis. I don't really care to deal with that at the moment. Power pill. Sure. And we can also do one magic point. So, talismans. Reduce enemy attack power. Summon fire for the weapon. Which we might very well do. Ooh, that's a good passive, actually. Hmm. <laughs> Conjures your guardian spirit. That's cool. Yeah, we're just gonna go with that passive, I think. That's worthwhile to have, no doubt. Um, for now, we're gonna pick things up here. Uh, we're gonna end things here, pick things up here next time, I should say. I hope you all have enjoyed this so far. I'm enjoying this game a lot. Truly fantastic. Really spot on with this game. But either way, thank you all for watching, and I will see you all next time.